does does human design give you a path to your life purpose does it kind of give you a hint on like what you should be focusing on or is it more just like this is your personality type well, it's deeper than personality type. So there are two sides. When you look at a chart, you'll see a, a, a row of like planets with numbers on two different sides of the chart. And one of that, the one side, which is usually referred to as the design side, that part is enco basically encoded into our bodies, 88 astrological degrees before we're born. And then the, the other side is the day we're born. And so when you put these together like there are certain things that are definitely innate in who we are so it's not just like a personality thing there are things that are going to um they're like in our genes right so it's not going to tell you what you should do but it'll tell you things like i can see that you're here you're a storyteller now does that mean you're going to write a book or does that mean you're going to have a podcast okay both um or does it mean that you're going to do that all you know some people might just do that all on their own they might they might write music right but so there it's going to tell you the qualities that you're meant to express it's not going to tell you what your career is um, it's not going to tell you who you should marry. Anybody who tells you that you can see compatibility in the human design chart, um, really look at that cautiously because there is no perfect design for you. It's just um, there are, what do you call it, relationship readings that are super helpful, but they don't tell you this person is wrong for you. They tell you how to navigate the energy in the most successful way or um you know, like some people will say, oh, type plus type, you know, like projectors are good with projectors. 